Saturday, the 9th of December, 2023. First reading. Reading from the book of Isaiah. Thus says the Lord God, the Holy One of Israel, People of Zion, you will live in Jerusalem and weep no more. He will be gracious to you when he hears your cry, when he hears he will answer. When the Lord has given you the bread of suffering and the water of distress, he who is your teacher will hide no longer, and you will see your teacher with your own eyes. Whether you turn to right or left, your ears will hear these words behind you. This is the way, follow it. He will send rain for the seed you sow in the ground, and the bread that the ground provides will be rich and nourishing. Your cattle will graze that day in wide pastures. Oxen and donkeys that till the ground will eat a salted fodder, winnowed with shovel and fork. On every lofty mountain, on every high hill there will be streams and watercourses, on the day of the great slaughter when the strongholds fall. Then moonlight will be bright as sunlight, and sunlight itself be seven times brighter, like the light of seven days in one. On the day the Lord dresses the wound of his people and heals the bruises his blows have left. Responsorial Psalm Happy are all who hope in the Lord. Praise the Lord for he is good. Sing to our God for he is loving. To him our praises do. The Lord builds up Jerusalem and brings back Israel's exiles. Happy are all who hope in the Lord. He heals the broken hearted. He binds up all their wounds. He fixes the number of the stars. He calls each one by its name. Happy are all who hope in the Lord. Our Lord is great and almighty. His wisdom can never be measured. The Lord raises the lowly. He humbles the wicked to the dust. Happy are all who hope in the Lord. Gospel Acclamation Alleluia, Alleluia. Seek the Lord while he is still to be found. Call to him while he is still near. Alleluia. Gospel Reading from the book of Matthew Jesus made a tour through all the towns and villages, teaching in their synagogues, proclaiming the good news of the kingdom and curing all kinds of diseases and sickness. And when he saw the crowds he felt sorry for them because they were harassed and dejected, like sheep without a shepherd. Then he said to his disciples, The harvest is rich but the laborers are few, so ask the Lord of the harvest to send laborers to his harvest. He summoned his twelve disciples and gave them authority over unclean spirits with power to cast them out and to cure all kinds of diseases and sickness. These twelve Jesus sent out, instructing them as follows, Go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel, and as you go, proclaim that the kingdom of heaven is close at hand. Cure the sick, raise the dead, cleanse the lepers, cast out devils. You received without charge, give without charge. Gospel of the Lord.